hello and welcome to my channel today i will show you the advanced maths we have already covered the standard maths and today we will cover the advanced math in advanced math the first math is profile center math so before starting profile center math basically the concept is in profile center we actually make the center of two objects two parts any two parts so let's start to make a duplicate copy of this object and drag this object like this okay Centric mesh to join these two objects, we will use this face, control this face, and make relation for insert. Again, using this face, control this face make relation concentric and using this face and control this face make relation concentric using three mesh using coincident concentric and concentric two we have logged the these two objects look at the message the selected component is fully defined let's use another map a profile map to do that suppress this map go to maps advanced map and select Profile center. As already discussed, in profile center, we have to select only two faces. So I am selecting this face and this face. And the object, the two parts have already met. There are many options like the dimensions the flip dimension the log rotation and the orientation inside the profile center mesh so we will use one by one this okay again go to profile center mesh left click edit features we can also give the distance between the two selected faces like To give five millimeter, but it take the distance in the opposite direction, so we will click the flip dimension. In this way, we have maintained a distance of five millimeter between these two selected faces. Press OK. So that's all about the profile center mesh. To delete the distance between these two parts, zero. Uncheck this flip dimension. Okay, you can change the orientation like this. You can change the orientation like this. You can change the orientation from these two options. Click OK. Now, what about the third option? Like the rotation option, the lock rotation option. To use the standard mesh, we use this space, control this space, and make relation concentric. 
and we will use the space and this space max relation for instance go to this map edit feature and here change the orientation okay we got this map we have matched this bold and this part but this part is still rotating in order to block the rotation we just select this space this space and make relation parallel to lock the rotation now subjective component is fully defined yes try another way right click select all the mesh and suppress the mesh using this mat the profile center mesh we can also join these two parts go to profile center go to mesh selection select this edge and this edge so by definition the center of the two selected edges has matched now what about the distance we don't need any distance and what about the lock rotation click ok using single mate we have complete log this component this object is fully defined hope you like this video please subscribe like and share